Alexis, Alexis. Hello, teacher. Good night. Hey, hello. How are you? Fine, teacher. And you? Okay, ready. Ready. Yeah, trying to set everything. Here we go again. Recognize Yeah, it's here. Okay, I'm already. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Hello. Let me see what time is it now. I don't know, but I, I, I see in a different way your camera, Rosa. Ah, está diferente, sí. Yeah. Yeah. Estoy en otro, en otro, en otro lugar, sí. Yeah. Yes. yeah. I mm -hmm. can see that you are in a different place today. Oh, yes. Okay. Welcome back. Okay, by the way, do you remember the name that I mentioned that is going to be for today? The one who is going to have the 10 minutes. ¿Se recuerdan a quién les mencioné que le correspondía el día de hoy? No. No. No, no. no. Ok, ya lo vamos a buscar. Ahí está apareciendo Walter también.
Almost ready. Almost ready. Ready. Yeah, we are close. Okay, today, let me see, Alexis. No, 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 let me see. Also, Carla Maria Lo Guevara Callejas is the one for today. Carla Maria Luz is the one. Okay, welcome back. Let me see. Eliane is there. Wilfredo. Here I am, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine. Okay, I've been I've been sending some reminding for you in order that you yeah. uh, update with your homeworks. Yes. Por ahí les estuve escribiendo a algunos para que se vayan eh, actualizando en las notas ya que estamos cerrando el módulo. Y eh, a algunos les hace falta la semana 4, lógico, vamos, no hemos terminado aún, pero hay que revisar algunas actividades que sí les están haciendo falta para poderles promediar. Teacher. Tell me. I have some trouble, but the, the exam number three. Okay. Uh, I texted you. Uh, I didn't check the hour, but uh, no. yeah, but I, I texted you 15 minutes ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. I saw you it. were busy. Yeah, yeah no, don't worry. Yeah, uh, but at, at the at the end of the of the session, I'm going to help you. Yeah, I am going to text you. If okay. You can help me because I I don't know what what happened, but I try to answer the question. But this I try to any any way, but nothing. Okay. And I don't know. If maybe you can help me, please. Yeah, yeah, Scott. I'm going. I'm going to help you. Thank you. Okay, uh, we got 14. Okay, let me see the attendance for today. Veamos la asistencia. Traten, por favor, de, por todos los medios de no faltar. Y cuando oigan su o escuchen su nombre, pues respondan lo más rápido posible para poderlo hacer rapidito. Okay, Ada Daisy. Present teacher. Eso. Uh, Alexis Antonio. Present teacher. Ahí está Alexis. Ana Roxana. Ana Roxana. Ahí está. Uh, Diana Carolina. Present teacher. Eh, Edward Ademir. Edward. Déjenme los fonos, por favor, si no los estamos usando. Eliani, ya la vi. Present. Fausto, is there? Present, teacher. Ok. Francisco Javier. Francisco. It's not there. Enara. Karen Yesenia. Present teacher. El día de ayer estuvo presente. No, teacher. Okay. 
We've got it here. Okay, Carla Maria Los. No ha llegado todavía. Present teacher. Ah, ahí está Carla. Se escondía. Mengíbar Contreras. Mengíbar Contreras. Leslie. Present teacher. Contreras todavía no. Ok, Gutiérrez Sánchez. Present teacher. Eh, Rosa Esperanza. Present teacher. Eh, Walter. Present eh, teacher. And Wilfred. Ok, estos son los que hay. Present teacher. At this moment. Ok. Ok, let us start today. Um, in order to start, I'm going to share with you some picture and we are going to talk about Okay. Okay, here we go. Good evening. Okay, I'm going to show you some picture and you are going to tell me something about it. Okay, Let's take a look at this picture first. Of course that we are talking about hotels. Okay, now take a look at this one. And now this one. What can you tell me about it? What we are going to talk about today? The last one, picture teacher. It is like a five-star hotel. Ah, okay. And the previous is medium, and then, but it is like my jar. <laughs> yeah, it, it looks like, it looks like. Okay, I don't know, uh, I would like to ask you this question. Have you ever traveled to Guatemala? Yeah. ¿Alguna vez ha viajado a Guatemala? Yes. 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 Teacher. Yes. yes teacher. Okay. Yes. If you had traveled to Guatemala, you had the opportunity to see that there you can find modern and antique uh, hotels. And and, and modern hotel teacher. Yeah. Okay, what about this one? Is mother or not? No, teacher. What about this one? It is mother than the previous. Okay. Now the question is going to be this. In which one do you prefer to stay? If you are going on vacation in this Easter term, uh, which one do you prefer? Tell me. I, I prefer teacher uh, enjoy my my next vacation vacation in a, in the last 
picture because I in can a, see in a mother very yeah in a mother because it like very very comfort okay what about an antique in the the first one yes it is like so old teacher <laughs> oh. but it is good it okay. is good because yeah it was, uh, all, all the pen off i i went i went to the antigua guatemala many many years ago and it like look very very nice to but i prefer in the modern hotel okay 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 with with elevator and jacuzzi and sauna and everything okay Okay, somebody else want to talk about this? In my case, teacher, uh, in vacation, uh, Panajachel. Ah, okay. Have you visited Panajachel? Yeah, yes. Uh, uh, estaba estudiando bachillerato. Ah, okay. Very, very Panajachel is a lake. Uh, yes. It is a lake. Yes. Okay. Uh, beautiful. Okay. And see the beautiful. Yes. How many days do you uh, did you spend there? Uh, three days. Three days. And what about the hotel? Was mother or antique? Uh, it's mother. Okay. Mother. And do you remember the services that you have? Uh, Yes, uh, service, uh, comfort room, uh, I don't remember teacher, I don't remember. Okay, okay, don't worry, when, don't, uh, don't worry about it. Okay, thank you. Okay, okay, that's it, that's good. Okay, somebody else wants to share your experiences? Okay, Rosa de Giron, tell us. What about you? Okay. Um, in vacation, the uh, years, last years, um, Antigua Guatemala. Um, we rent the house. Ah, okay. Uh, we rent the house. We rent the house by family. Okay. Um, very, muy, very, very good. Uh, in Pana, in Pana Chel. Pana Chel, okay. Pana Chel. Uh -huh. Yeah, Panama. Yes. Okay. Um, oh. House. House particular. Ah, in a particular house. Uh, particular house. Um, the uh, TV, uh, the kitchen, uh, the beds. Um, Okay. 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 Thank you. Somebody else wants to tell me something about it? Alguien más quiere decirnos algo respecto? No. Okay. Let me see. Oh, Roxana, I, 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 let me see. I didn't mention your name, Roxana. Let me see, Roxana, 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 Roxana. Anna Roxana Bautista is present, right? Hi, teacher. I do, sorry about it. Yeah, problem internet. 
Okay, internet problem. Okay. Teacher. Hi. I, I guess that the difference in the, um, we can say between hotel, antique hotel or modern hotel. Yeah, between is means too. Okay. Uh, I guess that the, the difference is the, the service that modern hotel can offer to the customer. Because the last year I had the opportunity to to go to Scalibur Hotel in Vegas. Okay. And I can uh, uh, I how do you say pude ver. I could see. I could see the difference in it's very, very nice the service. Full full service. Yeah. It is all okay. Was really uh, nice. Yeah, I guess that the difference is the service that they can offer all your customers. Yes. Well, sometimes uh, has to do with the services, but sometimes uh, also is just uh, talking about the buildings. But uh, sometimes they have uh, old buildings, but they have good services too. All depend. But in Tesh, uh cities like United States or Europe, uh, of course they they have modern buildings and they offer everything, a lot of different kind of services too. Okay. Okay, let me see. Here we go. Okay. The question is, we are going to work in exercise number one. Do you prefer to stay in modern or antique hotel when you travel? Okay, you already answered this question. Do you usually make your hotel reservation or someone else does it, does, does it for you? Usualmente es usted el que hace la reservación o alguien más la hace por ustedes. Chame. La reservación la hacemos desde casa antes de salir eh, para decir cuántos días se va a estar, este, eh, que, cuáles son las uh, pero no. Bueno, desde casa lo hacemos. From home, from home. From home, using, yeah, uh -huh. using From uh, home. could be using the WhatsApp or using the different kind of social media, right? Uh, social media. Okay. Okay, what about activity number two? Listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with the pattern. It is a phone call to a hotel. Let us see. Let us see it, please. Okay. Hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jem. How can I help you? Hello. I need to make your reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay. This conversation is uh, very clear. I invite you to read it again in order that you can get familiar with the vocabulary. And then we are going to practice with somebody else. If you want, I can read it again in order that you can listen carefully. Or if, so, if someone wants to help me, uh, it's gonna be good too.
Okay, I'm gonna do it. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jim. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. Uh, how long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay. Any question about a word or something that you consider that is not clear for you? It is clear, teacher. Yeah, it's, it's really clear. Okay, let me see how many do we have. Okay, we have 14. I need that you practice with somebody else. Uh, let us do it now. And then we are going to do it right here. Okay, break our room. But so please go to the room that I assigned you. Pero les pido de favor que vayan al, al, al room que se les asigna. Okay, here we go. Carla Marielos, are you alone? Carla, can you hear me? Carla. Okay, you are with Edward. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. So. Can you see my screen, Edward? Yes, yes. Okay, we, we have a, a conversation that your classmates are practicing. Yeah, se escucha entrecortado, teacher. Se escucha entrecortado. Really? What about now? Can you hear me very well? Can you hear me very well? Yes, teacher. Okay. Maybe everybody is having trouble. What about you, Carolina? Uh, you are with somebody else practicing the conversation or not? Let me see. Diana, you are with Rosa de Giron. Wait. <laughs> and Rosa. Solo que Con, okay. con Rosa ya entramos tarde. Sí, sí. que estábamos solas y cuando ya nos encontramos ya nos estaba sacando. Así que vamos a vamos a intentarlo. <ríe> okay. Okay. Inicia usted Rosa. Diana. Hello. 
Sí, hello, thank you for calling the, the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jane. How can I help you? Help you. Hello, I need to make a reservation. Little sure. My I have your name, please. Of course. I'm oh. Gerardo Gomez. Uh, uh -huh. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on uh, Friday 14. How long are you going to stay while you use Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay stay you hunting Monday are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room a single room please okay okay a single 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 for a single single yeah. room please mm -hmm. <laughs> Single one. Is a thing, I have a teacher. Single. Single. Okay, everybody having some problem? Oh, okay, um, me teacher. You are using digital, digital. I'm waiting the rest of people, the rest of crew, I can see it. I don't see the rest, where they are. Okay, there, here we go. Drinking some lemonade, drinking water, doing a lot of things. <laughs> okay, that is good. Okay, let us start. Uh, I need a volunteer couple in order that you practice the conversation with, with your partner. Me, teacher. Okay, who is your partner, sir? Karen. Okay, go ahead. Karen, are you ready? Yes. And you start, and you start, Karen. Teacher, right. teacher, uh, please, podía compartir la... Ah, the screen, okay, okay, okay. Please. Please, don't go, it's a fancy one, okay. Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm, I'm listening a feedback. I don't know. Okay, thank you. No, sé, alguien ahí. Okay. Um, Inicio. Okay. Um, okay. Um, okay. Hello, thank you. Okay. You're for Kelly to Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make you a reservation. Sure. Uh, may I have your name, please? Of course, I am Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to, to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday uh, 14. How long are you going to stay with you, Mr. Gomez? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Finish. 
Okay, thank you. Single, single, single. 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 Yeah, this, this expression single. also we use it when, when you are not married, you say, okay, I'm single. Yeah. I'm single. Single, single yeah. también es soltero. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. okay, somebody else wants to do it? Just tell me. The teacher. Okay. Stephanie. Stephanie, where are you? Hello, thank you for calling to Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sir, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. Where are you going to arrive? I am going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Gomez? I am going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make this reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Finish? Okay, okay. Thank you. Somebody else? Somebody else wants to do it? Somebody else wants to do it? Eliane, are you there? Okay. Me, hey, teacher. We should partner. Exactly. Okay, here we go. Let us do it. From Chalatenango, La Palma. Yeah, okay. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make the reservation. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I am Leslie Fernandez. Thank you, Mr. Fernandez. When are you going to arrive? I am going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with you, Mr. Fernandez? I am going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room is finished. Finish the chart. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to put it again. I'm going to share it again and I'm going to read it again. Listen, listen. Before that somebody else do it, I'm going to read it. Hello, thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jim. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I hear your name, please? Of course. I'm Gerardo Gomez. Thank you, Mr. Gomez. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14th. How long are you going to stay with us? Mr. Gomez, I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay. Somebody else wants to do it? Um, me teacher. Okay. Both of you say me at the same time. I don't know, you decide. Go ahead, sir. Hello. Do it, do it, do it. Okay. Um, hello. Thank you for you calling the Holsen Star Hotel. This is Jen. How how can help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. Um, Edward Noyola. Thank you, Mr. Noyola. 
When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Noyola? I'm going, I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make it the reservation for Zoom single or double room? A uh, single room, please. Okay. Finish. Okay. I need to highlight some words. Single. Yeah, in order that, that, that you keep in mind, single, single, stay with us. Single, single. Remember that we have object and subject pronouns. Do you remember that? Stay with us, stay with me, stay with them. Yeah. And what else? Let me see something now here. Hey, okay. All right. uh, yeah, we need to be careful about because uh, at the moment that we are reading, we need to take care of every word that we have here in order that you can listen in a good way, right? Okay, somebody else? Somebody else wants to do it? No? Me, teacher. Okay, tell me. Oh, Mr. Francisco Alvarenga. Okay, Francisco Alvarenga. Let me see Francisco Ready. in the in the Ready, ready, teacher. Okay. Yeah. I Hello. Have... Hello. Thank you for calling the Golden Star Hotel. This is Jen, how can I help you? Hello, I need to make a reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Francisco Alvarenga. Thank you, Mr. Alvarenga. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Friday uh, 14th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Alvarenga? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A single room, please. Okay, finish teacher. Okay, 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 okay. This is double, double room. Double room. Yeah. Okay, let us continue. Um, we are going to work in exercise number three, pair word. Fill the form with the information from the conversation and compare your answer with a pattern. Okay, we are going to work in this activity. The Golden Star Hotel Reservation Firm. Uh, you are going to fill out the, the agent, the guest, the check-in, the check-out. If you are going to have a single room or a double room. Okay, let us do it now, please. Let's do it, let's do it. Remember that uh, this information is based on the on the conversation that we have here. La información que van a necesitar para llenarlo está justo en la conversación. Quién okay. es el agente, quién es el uh, el guest, uh, when is going to be the check in, and when is going to be the check out. Cuando será el check in y cuando será el check out. 
And if he is going to uh, book a single or a double run. Okay. Okay, do it, please. Jen, this is Jen. Did you finish? I finished, teacher. Okay. Yes, I did, teacher. Okay, let us check up what you have done. Let me see. Okay, what about the agent? Who is the agent? Jen. Jenny. Jen. 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 Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to, uh, I need that all of you get familiar with the breakout room. Necesito que todos se familiaricen con el breakout room. Lo vamos a poner corto y con la persona que les asigne pueden comparar sus respuestas. Lo vamos a hacer cortito para que sea rápido. Let me see one minute. Okay, I'm going to recreate and you are going to share the info with all of them, okay? Okay, let's do it now.
Ok. Welcome back, Menjibar. Hi, teacher. Hello, how are you? Good evening, everybody. Just arriving at this morning, okay? Okay. Okay, don't worry about it. Okay, um, did you compare the information that you have with your, with your pattern? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, yes, teacher. Francisco, could you give me the name of the guest? Who is the guest? Yes, teacher. The guest. Ah, ah, Gerardo. The full name is? The complete name? Gerardo, and the last name? Gomez. Ah, Gerardo Gomez. Oh, Gerardo Gomez, Gerardo okay. Gomez. Sí. Okay, 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 okay. Let me see somebody else wants to send me some, let me see. Mm, okay. What about the check-in, Carla? When is going to be the check-in? Friday 14. Okay, nice. Alexi Antoni, what about the checkout? Monday, teacher. Until Monday, okay. Also, uh, is he going to book a single room or a double room? It's going to be single or double run? Uh, single run. Okay, 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 okay. Single run. Okay, nice. Let us work in exercise number four, making a hotel reservation. Uh, right here, you are going to pretend that you are doing a reservation and you are going to use good life for a very polite request. For example, you can say, I would like to make a reservation, or also you can use the word need and one are also possible, but less polite. Remember that uh, good lie is the best polite. But you can, you can use one, you can use, you, you can say I want, I want to make a reservation. I need to make a reservation. But if you want to be really polite, you are going to say a good light. I would like to make a reservation. Okay. I'm going to give you some minutes in order that you can uh, think about it. What about if you were with your last partner in, in the last activity that we did? 
¿Qué les parece si trabajan la conversación con la última persona que estuvieron haciendo la, la última actividad? Uno podría ser el agent, el otro podría ser el, el customer o client. Eh, teacher, no sé, tuve problemas con el internet porque no me pude conectar con nadie. Ah, ok. Ok, go ahead. You can do it alone if you want. Si no tienen con quién trabajar, yo seré el recepcionista, no problem at all. Hotel Sheraton President is going to be mine. El Crown Plaza. Ah, el Crown Plaza también, ok. Crown Plaza. Ok, nice. Ya es más moderno. <risa> Okay, I'm going to take. Uh... Teacher, puede compartir la la imagen porfa. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Is there? Is there? Okay, let me let, let me check out the the attendance the attendance again. Edward is here. What about Henara? No. Here, Henara is not here. And remember that you can uh, click on this link later on and you are going to have more information about something. Uh, talking about grammar, explanation and practice. Remember that if we are going to be polite, really polite, we are going to use good light. But also you can say, I want to make a reservation. I need to make a reservation and so on. Okay, don't worry about it. Later on, maybe we are going to create a whole conversation. Right now, you just can tell me uh, what you have. Do you want to share it?
Okay, time is over. Time is over. Just tell me. Just tell, tell me. Uh, imagine that you are uh, pretending to make a hotel reservation. Just tell me how you how you are going to do it. Later on, we are going to finish the the conversation, right? But right now, just tell me your ideas. Who wants to start now? Who wants to start? You can share general information, but the most important thing here is that you use the expression that I already showed you. Diana is ready. Diana is ready. Creo que sí. Diana, Carolina is ready. Okay, go ahead. Uh, hello. Thank you for calling Luna Jena. Hello. I would like to make a reservation for two person. Sure. May I have your name? Of course. I reservation for uh, Diana Doñan. Thank you, Miss Doñan. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Saturday 30. 30. Saturday 30. Okay. Hasta allí, teacher. Okay, okay. If you want, you can mention only just the part that, that you are. Uh, the one that you are going to make the reservation, you just your information. Pueden usar solo su información, but, but, I, but I want, what I want to listen is that you say, I would like to make a reservation for uh, two days, for one week, I'm going to stay, okay? Don't worry about it, don't worry about it, okay? Okay, let us continue with We are going to have time in order to do it. Okay, don't worry about it. Okay, take a look of this topic. How to use be going to how we are going to, to use it. Before to study this topic, I need that you remember the use of B. How we are going to use B. In present, uh, B have, uh, has a three different way. I already explained you, am, um, is, and are. All depend on the personal pronoun that you are going to use. And that way you are going to use one of the B form. For example, we say, I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, uh, they are, we are, okay? And based on that, we are going to talk about this topic. Okay, look at the words involved in a complete and then complete the sentences below. This is the instruction that we have. As you can see here in the conversation, we can find some word involved. For example, when are you going to arrive? Or 
I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. Or maybe it could be, how long are you going to stay with us? These are question form. And this is positive, I'm, I'm going to stay. Are you going to make the reservation? Okay. We have affirmative sentences. For example, I'm going to arrive on Friday 14. I'm going to stay until Monday. Miss Puentes is going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. What about negative sentences? Mrs. Puentes is not going to fly to Cuba on the 14th. Mr. Gomez is not going to arrive on Thursday. 13. As you can see, if we are going to create sentences in negative form, what we are going to do is just to add the word not between the be form and the going to. Para hacer las negativas, lo que vamos a hacer es agregar la partícula not en medio de la forma del be y el going to. Y ahí estará ya en negativa. Okay, but don't worry that we are going to go deep in this topic. What about just no question? Are you going to stay in a smoking or not a smoking room? Are you, we switch the position, the sentence was you are, but in this case, if we are talking about question, we need to put the B form at the beginning. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? These are yes, no question. And this one are uh, information question. When we use WH word question, how long are you going to stay? When are you going to arrive? And let us see right here, use be going to plus the verb, be form to describe a schedule activities and activities that will definitely happen in the future. For negative sentence, insert not before going to. Para oraciones negativas, vamos a insertar la partícula not antes del going to. And at the right to ask yes, no question about schedule activities, begin with the verb be. Para hacer preguntas de yes, no question, pregunta, la respuesta simple de sí o no. Vamos a hacer uso, uh, vamos a comenzar con la forma del be plus the subject plus going to plus the verb. Esa es la fórmula. And for information question, just play the WH word phrase at the beginning of the question and continue like you could do for a yes no question. So eso es lo que cambia y lo demás es igual. But in order to explain you this topic more specific, I would like to share with you some information that I have here. Let me see. I'm going to share with you something else. Okay, here we go. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on a second. Hold on, hold on. I need to start right here. Okay, okay, here we go. Okay. Somebody wants to read this word, please. Future. Okay, the future. We are talking about the future. Okay. Nice. Do you like the view? Do you like the view, the countryside? Yes. 
Okay. Yeah, in order to relax and walk. You can walk there without shoes, you know. Okay. Um, going to, we are going to read the sentences and pay attention to the use of going to. For example, am I going to eat out tonight? And, and we have the question mark right here. Mr. Wolf is going to stay home. What are you going to do tomorrow? Pay attention to what they're going to, please. I'm going to visit my grandmother. How are you going to get there? I'm going to walk through the forest. Please be careful. These are all like the answer of this question. I need that you pay a special attention to the going to. Take a look. Obsérvelas detenidamente para que vean dónde van, cómo van. Okay. We use the future with going to to talk about plans. And we have positive form. We have the subject that in this case could be I. And this is what I, I was talking about. I was talking about, okay, the verb to be, I am. I am going to dance. He, she, and it is going to use is. He is going to, she is going to, it is going to. Okay, and at the end, we are going to use we, you, and they with are. We are going to study. You are going to go shopping. Uh, they are going to dance. And we have some example here. Who wants to read the first one for me, please? Quien quiere leer el primero, por favor? Primer ejemplo. Me teacher. Ok, 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 ok. Jose me. Go ahead. Wilfredo, Wilfredo, I guess. Ah, ok. María is going to travel this holiday. Ah, ok. Take a look at María in the P form, please. Ok, second, the lady. Lady. They, me teacher. They are going to go to very expensive restaurant. Very expensive oh. restaurant. Okay. 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 I need that you pay a special attention to these two words. Because, okay. Somebody wants to read the last one, please. Me, teacher. Me, teacher. Okay. Quien, quien dijo primero, please. I'm going to come home late. Okay. I need that you can have a clear idea when we have apostrophes. Cuando tenemos apostrophes, necesito que tengan una idea muy clara. Por ejemplo, si yo no tuviese la apostrofe, aquí dice, Maria is going to travel this holiday. But in this case, say Mary is going to travel this holiday. The second one, si no tuviese el apostrofe, diría they are going to. But in this case, say they're going to a very expensive restaurant. And the last one, si no tuviese el apostrofe, diría I am going to. But in this case, say I'm going to come home late. Okay. 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 Keep it in your in your mind. Cuando estamos hablando usamos formas cortas para escribir lo hacemos usando formas largas. Y lo más importante que nos quede claro es que el is lo vamos a usar con terceras personas que ya puede ser él, ella o el it. Y are lo vamos a usar con we, you, and they. Y am, lo vamos a usar con la primera que sería I. 
si nos aprendimos eso, ya avanzamos. Okay, what about the negative form? In the negative form, we have the subject, we have the verb to be plus not. Tenemos la forma del be más la partícula not, and then we are going to have going to. Luego tendremos el going to and the infinitive right here. Example, I am not going to clean. She or he is not going to cook. But in this case, you can say isn't. He isn't going to cook. Yeah, instead of say is not. We, you, and they are not or aren't going to travel. Yeah? Going to travel. Going to cook, going to clean. Example, who wants to read the, the first one? Alguien de los que no han participado, por favor. Me, teacher. Okay, tell me. I'm not going to go to the party. Okay, no va a ir a la fiesta. Se la pierde, okay. <laughs> Next, somebody else? Juan isn't going to work today. No quiere trabajar, no va a trabajar Juan. Okay, the last one? They aren't going to stay at, at, the, at that hotel. Sí, okay. Ellos no trabajarán en ese hotel. Okay, is that clear? Yes. yes. But what about the rest? Yes or not? Tell me. Tell me, tell me. Okay, let us see question form. Okay, question where? W H word question. Uh, then we are going to add the uh, bear to be the subject going to end the infinity. For example, I can say what am I'm not. In this case, I can use uh, in in a negative way or without the word not. What am I going to do? ¿Qué es lo que voy a hacer? Where is he going to go? ¿A dónde irá él? ¿Ya? Yeah. Where are we going to travel? Ya, yeah, be careful with this, uh, with negative. If you are going to, this is the same, this is the short form. Esta es la forma corta. Instead of say is not, you say isn't, are not, aren't, and so on. Example, alguien que no haya leído, por favor, tell me. Me, teacher. Okay, tell me, Francisco Alvarenga. What are you going to do later? What are you going to do later? Okay. Later. 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 Yeah. ¿Qué hará más tarde? ¿Qué hará más tarde? Okay, somebody else want to read the, the second? Me teacher. Okay, tell me, Leslie. What is she going to the cook? Okay, read again, please. What is she going to cook? Ah, ahí está. What is she going to cook? ¿Qué, co qué cocinará ella? Okay. Okay, somebody else? Number three. Okay, okay. Número tres, ¿quién la lee? Me, teacher. Karen. Are they going to attend the meeting? Ok, ahora démosle entonación. Are they going to attend the meeting? Repeat, please. Are they going to... To attend... attend to, to attend, a, to attend the meeting. To attend the meeting? The meeting. Yeah, are they going to attend the meeting? Are they... Uh, are they going to attend the meeting? Yes, okay. And the last one. Hello. Somebody else? Hey, hey, buddy. Hey, teacher, no. where, is, where is Maria going to study? 
Where is Maria going to study? Okay. Donde estudiará Maria? Okay, take a look, take a look. These are called information questions. Son preguntas de información. Okay, no question? Do you have a question? No? no question. Okay. No. Okay, okay, okay. Tell me here, what are they going to do? What are they going to do? Take a look at the picture. Try to try to guess what they are going to do. Tell me. They are camping. Ah, but how you are going to create the, the, the answer for this question? What are they going to do? Yeah, you need to pay they a special coming. attention to this, okay? Tell me. They are they going are. to a camping. Okay. In this case, you take the B form. En este caso, para responder, toma la forma del B, la pone adelante del de pronombre y they are going to in the infinity verb, right? Okay. They are going to do something. Uh -huh. Okay, 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 okay. What about this one? What is going to happen there? Tell me. He's going to drive in a bus. Yeah, but what is going to happen? Maybe he is going to go very, very, very fast and he's lost in the control. <laughs> okay. He, he is going to hide an accident. He is going to? Be. Hit. He is going to hit an accident. Hit a chocar, creo. He is going to have an accident. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Have. He is going to have an accident. He is going to have an accident. To have. Okay, let us. No me han adivinado una todavía. Or what about this one? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Tell me. They are going to victories. Take okay, a but, but take a look at the, the question. What, is, what are you going to do? He, he is, I am going to take a picture. Uh, I am going to take a picture. Let me see. Nice. Let us see. The next one, what is going, what is he going to do? He is going to watch TV. Let me see. He is going to... Yeah. Okay, the last one. One more. Pero necesito que participen los que no han participado. Please, what is Tom going to do? Tell me. What is Tom going to do? What is Tom going to do? Hello. I already gave you a hint. Tom 
is going to wash his car. Tom is going to wash. Lavar. Okay, let us see, let us see, let us see. Clean. Clean. Okay, well done, well done. One more? Yes. Okay. What about this one? What is going to happen there? What is going to happen? Piensa, piensa, piensa. He is going to um, room. Mm. Ya le di una manito, mire. He is going to. <laughs> yeah. He is going to. Go. No. Go later. No. Going for work. <laughs> what about the bear here? Going to go later for work. Yes. Get to go later for go. Yes, teacher. Somebody else want to say something? He's about going it? to go late, late for work. Late for work. But what about the bear here? Tell me. Time, teacher. Mm. Yes. Time have. is not there. To have. To have life of work. Go or get. Okay, let us see. Let us see. B. B. Yeah, he's going to be late for work. He's going to, yeah. he's going to be late. Esta tarde para el trabajo. Yes. Okay. What about this one? What is Calvin going to do? Take a look. What is Calvin going to do? Copiando. He's going to copying. <laughs> yeah. Take a look at this picture. Okay, vean esa figura. Cuando el teacher pregunta algo y dice no vean, vean, take a look at this picture. Okay, como nadie me dijo, entonces voy a hacer la última esta. ¿Ya? Yeah. He is going to look. look in his English test. Mm -hmm. I don't think so that the word is look. He is going to. Yes. ¿Qué está haciendo él? To be mirando. Yeah, but, uh, pero para qué está mirando? Para copiar. Para copiar. Ah, how do you say copiar <laughs> in English? <laughs> how do you say copiar in English? <laughs> Tell me. Yeah. Here we go. Copy. He's copy. going to cheat or copy. When somebody yeah. says he's going to somebody... tengo una consulta. Okay, tell me. Tell me. Vaya. Se supone que es el uso del going to es para referirse a cosas que en el futuro sucederán. Y que está seguro que va a suceder. Yes. Pero en estos ejemplos lo estamos diciendo como que está, está sucediendo. Pasando. ¿Solo es por práctica o también se utiliza así? Yeah, uh, uh, let me tell you something about it. How can I explain you this? Ok, for example, ahorita estamos viendo la figura aquí. ¿Ya? Yeah? Y yo estoy usando la imagen para, para referirme como que si algo va a suceder, ¿ya? Entonces, por eso la pregunta decía que what is Calvin going to do? ¿Qué hará Calvin? ¿Ya? En, 
estamos suponiendo algo al inicio. Entonces alguien viene y da una respuesta y él dice, he's going to cheat o copy in his English test. Él copiará, hará trampa en su examen. Y entonces esta imagen como que si estamos viendo ya el futuro de lo que va a suceder. Eso, ah, okay. sí, eso, solo eso estaba es, como sí, que es Sí, es solamente para que se comprenda el contenido okay. de, de, de las letras. Ah, ok. okay. Gracias. Ok. And this is going to be, what are you going to do? Tell me. No idea. What are you going to do? No idea. Okay. I remember I, the question. What are you I going, I going to, to make a cake? I am going to. Okay, let us I, see. I, I, she, I am going to make. Okay. I, am, I am going to make or bake a cake. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let us stop seeing this picture. Uh, vamos a la mitad ahorita. Sí. Okay, vamos a dejar para más tarde. Please. Okay, I'm going back again to our book. You already have an explanation here. And, uh, okay, based on this, basado en la explicación que está acá y la observación que hacía, eh, La compañera dice, to describe a schedule activities, an activity that will definitely happen in the future, para describir actividades que ya están programadas y actividades que sucederán en el futuro. Futuro. Ok. Comprendamos esa parte. Exercise number five, order the words to create sentences and questions about schedule activities. And we have an example. When are you going to arrive to Dallas? And we have here in this order to Dallas, you're going to when arrive are. Okay. Um, I'm going to give you three minutes to do this, please. Tenemos tres minutos para hacer este ejercicio. Or maybe more. I'm talking about the number five, I'm talking about this one. Okay. Teacher. Tell me. Usando únicamente las, las, las palabras que están en el, en, ahí en el, en el cuadro. Yes. Aquí arriba dice, ordene las palabras para crear oraciones y preguntas. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, take your time, don't worry about it. Tómese su tiempo, tranquilitos, tranquilitos. Okay, let me see. Genara, are you there, Genara? Genara is not here. No. Thank 
Can you mute your, your microphone, please? Okay, can you tell me? Do you finish? Finish, teacher. Okay. Somebody else? <laughs> Ok, 
Finish teacher. Okay, okay. Finish teacher. Okay. Okay, who wants to start with the number two, please? Our okay, go ahead, go ahead. Tell me. Are you are you are you going to make reservation for the conference room? Repeat again. Could you repeat again, please? Repeat again, are, for. Are you going to make uh and reservation reservation for the conference room okay are you going okay that's it because at the beginning you didn't mention the word a that the letter sorry no mencionó la letra a okay okay el resto tome anotaciones ahí okay number three tell me Tell me about the number three. Um, I'm going to wake up for request 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Okay, okay, again, please. I'm going to wake up for request 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. Hello. What about the order? Remember that after after going to, we need to have the infinitive. Después uh -huh. del going to, necesitamos tener el infinitivo. Entonces va a decir. I. Uh -huh, I'm going to. Going to. Wake up call. Mm. Or request. Uh -huh. I'm going to request. Request, perdón. A, uh, a wake uh, up call. Wake up call. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm going to request for. Yeah. Yeah. What about for? Where do you put it? ¿Dónde le puso el for? For six a.m. Okay, I am going to request a wake up call for mm -hmm. 5 a.m. Okay, number four, number four, please. Número cuatro, por favor. Mrs. Turcios. 
Mrs. Turcios is going to check check up tomorrow. Okay, Mrs. Mrs. Miss Turcios is going Ms. is going to check out tomorrow. Okay. Okay, number five. On conferring, going to a uh, maintenance team is at 10, the October 10th. Okay, who wants to tell me this? Number five. Uh, Seria, the conference is going to attend maintenance, maintenance team on October 10th. Mm. The conference is yeah, going yeah, to yeah. attend Okay. Maintenance team on October 10th. Yeah, before to start, we need to look what, what is the subject of this sentence. And the subject is going to be at the beginning. La What's conferencia. It? Será la conferencia? Porque el verbo tu que está ahí es is. Yeah, but what about this one? Ellos van a es, o sea, por eso, bueno, no olvide. <laughs> Okay, I, I, I got your, your message. But what about this one? Este equipo. Entrenamiento. Okay, somebody else wants to tell me something about it? The maintenance team. Ah, okay. El equipo. Entrenamiento. Is going to. Is going to attend. Ah, uh, is going to conference. Is going to attend the conference. Attend. Attend. Attend the conference. The on October ten. Conference. The conference. On October ten. Okay. Uh, could you repeat again, please, Wilfredo? Puede repetirla de nuevo. Maintain. Maintain. Yeah, remember that you need to have an article at the beginning. Yeah. This is the article. Read it, please. Read it. Okay. The, the mental team is going to attend a conference in October 10. Okay, the maintenance team is going to attend a conference on October 10. El sujeto sería el equipo de mantenimiento recibirá una conferencia en octubre 10 o el 10 de octubre. ¿Te comprende? Porque si el equipo es más de una persona, no tendría que ser R. En Consulta, this, no sé. Yeah, yeah, I know your question. Sí, pero aquí dice el equipo es uno. Que el equipo esté conformado por varias personas es totalmente diferente. Pero el equipo es singular. Se comprende. Yeah. Señorita. Teacher. Hola. Will you show the, the, the answer, please? I need to check. Do you want to show the answers of this? Yeah, please. Okay, okay, okay. Let us finish this one and I'm going to show you. Hagamos la última y luego les muestro las respuestas. Okay. Okay, what about number six? Non-smoking room. Mrs. Diaz. Uh, need is going to. How is it? Mr. Mrs. 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 Diaz. Mrs. Mrs. Diaz. Is going, uh, to. going to. Going to. Uh, need. need. Going to need. A non-smoking room. Um, Smoking room. Okay. Ah, uh, but but we have a, a problem there. Do you know why? 
How you, how you are going to start the question? ¿Cómo va a iniciar la pregunta? Is, ah, is, is, is Mr. Diaz? Is Miss Diaz? Miss Diaz? Yeah. Uh, going to a new smoking room. Mm. Okay, pay attention. I'm going to tell you the answers. The second one, are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? Mm -hmm. Are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? Como íbamos a saber que era pregunta, teacher. Ah, okay. Good question. Good question. Tienen el signo. La primera sí, pero okay. por el okay. pero. Okay, aquí arriba dice, order the words to create sentences and question. Mm -hmm. about the schedule activities. Okay, how we are going to know that they are going to be question or sentences is a good question, right? Porque no todas tienen el signo de, de el question mark. Ninguna. Ya, yeah, ninguna tiene cierto. Está en lo correcto. La instrucción debería, como debería de tenerlo, ¿no? Pero a uh, Más que todo, si el ejemplo nos está dando, aunque aquí la instrucción dice que cree oraciones y preguntas. Pero si nosotros vemos uh, toda la, 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 la estructura de cómo está hecha, pues no, nos daremos cuenta de que solamente quizá la última Sería, sería como pregunta, aunque no tenga el símbolo ahí. Porque no se le, no se le puso. Ahora, ¿qué pasaría, por ejemplo, si esta, la última, yo la quiero hacer oración? Podría funcionar también. Mis días is going to... ¿Ya? Yeah. Yeah, we, we, we can aquí podemos crearla, podemos hacer las oraciones simples o podemos hacerlas en preguntas. Ahí dependerá de el alcance que tengamos. En este caso, por ejemplo, uh, pues la respuesta sería la número dos. Are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? Si no fuese pregunta, ¿cómo sería? Solo vamos a mover el, el, la forma del B para después del pronombre. You, you are going, are going to make a reservation for the conference room. Yes. Pero ahí como que sería el jefe que le está diciendo qué es lo que va a hacer. Ya. Ok, la número tres les quedaría. I'm going to request a wake up call for 5 a.m. Mm -hmm. Number four sería Miss Turcios is going to check out tomorrow. Yes. Number five. The maintenance team is going to attend a conference on October 10. And the last one is Miss Diaz going to need a non-smoking room. Yeah, el detalle. Solo debemos de jugar con la forma del B. Ok, based on the time, basado en el tiempo, let us work in exercise number six, where uh, your turn. Think of two business events that you are going to attend, a signed day for each and practice making a hotel reservation for those days. Al inicio ya ustedes estaban creando unas conversaciones. Solo es de que las pulamos y luego las hacemos rapidito para que salgamos con el tiempo. Do you remember that? That I told you to create a conversation. ¿Alguien ya la tenía elaborada? ¿La podría leer, por favor? 
solo o con su compañero? Para que no, it's el going to. Sí, ¿verdad? Yes. That you are going to attend. It is like uh, making a hotel reservation. Lo que va a hacer solo es hacer una, una reservación de hotel. Es la conversación que ya estábamos haciendo. Pero dice que tenemos que poner dos eventos de trabajo y asignarle fecha o no. Yeah, but in this case, we are going to do it in a general way. Lo vamos a hacer en forma general. Solo ah, okay. practicando eh, la reservación del hotel. Para que nos salga más corto, para, para poder hacerlo, por lo menos dos o tres. May I to try, teacher? Okay, go, go ahead, sir. Hello. Thank, thank you for Kodas Hotel Primavera. It is going to be a pleasure to attend you. May I help you? Yes, please. I would, I would like to make a reservation. Okay. When are you going to need to make a reservation? I need to make a reservation for the next weekend. Okay. Are you going to need a single room? Or double room. Double room, please, because I am going to arrive with my family. Okay. This is no problem. We are going to attend you and your family. Thank you. Welcome. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Somebody else? Alguien más? ¿Puede hacerlo con algún compañero? Only one or two, no more. I see a lot of hands. Solo uno o dos, veo muchas manos indicando. Please. Okay, alguien más, alguien más. Yo, teacher. Okay, tell me. I would like to go to your hotel. May I tell me what kind of room there are in the hotel? Of course, there are three rooms with view at ocean on top floor and three room first floor. Also three room, but the view at the park. I would like to room with view at ocean on top floor. Okay. How long are you going to stay with us? I'm going to stay until four days. Okay, may I have your personal information? Yes, of course. Okay, nice. Thank you, somebody else? Only one, only one, because of the time. Hey, teacher. Okay, tell me. Hello, good morning. Uh, you can help. You can help me. Uh, um, I need your reservation, double room, for next weekend, for for three persons for two days. Uh, uh, how the much? How much is it? How much? Is it? Okay, 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 okay. Well, thank you very much. In order to finish, I would like to ask you to share with me something about the vocabulary that we started today. Alguien que quiera compartir el vocabulario de lo que hablamos hoy?
Yeah, and if you were, just tell me, okay, today we talk about this, we mention this, you tell us this. Okay, tell me. Hágame un resumen así rápido de lo que hablamos hoy, but in English, please. Um, about uh, hotel reservation. Okay, about hotel reservation. Okay, what else? You should be, be going to. Ah, the you should be going to, okay. Somebody wants to give me an example using going to? So teacher, today, how can we make a reservation and yeah. how can we use a going to? For example, uh -huh. tomorrow, I am going to go to work. Okay. I'm going to sleep. As soon as I finish, I go, um, I am going to my bed, okay? <laughs> yeah, that's nice. I'm going to okay. Sleep. I'm going to sleep. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, I hope to see you tomorrow. Don't forget to finish your homework. Uh, Carla is going to stay 10 minutes more in order to ask me some questions to clarify. I don't know if you are there, Carla. Okay, for the rest, uh, I want to thank you for being part of this class today and I hope to see you tomorrow, okay? Bye-bye. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Good night, good night. See you tomorrow. Okay, see you tomorrow. Good night, see you tomorrow. Okay. 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 Genara no apareció, Genara. Ok, Genara no apareció. Teacher. Ay, tell me. I send you, I send you a picture when you can see. Okay. The, uh, my, my, if, or. The test? Yes, because I, I don't know, because I try to many, many ways, but I am, I, I didn't find a... The way how to solve it? Yeah. Okay. okay. Maybe I'm... if you can help me, please. Yeah. Okay. okay, I'm going to take a look as soon as okay. I finish, I'm going to send you a message. Okay, please okay. teacher. Okay, thank you. See you tomorrow. Okay, take see you tomorrow, bye. Bye teacher. Okay, Carla. Now you are going to have a minute to ask me a question. No sé, en español, uh, si tiene algún problema con algún tema que hayamos visto. Ahorita lo podemos uh, ejemplificar. Me quedaba una, una duda con lo de, de uso de, de good y el good. Que a, la, que a la hora de responder, o sea, no se puede responder como como normalmente lo hacemos, como cuando decimos I am. Ajá, uh, I, I got it, I got it, yes. Sí, uh, en los ejemplos que le dimos, hay algunos ejercicios donde se esperaba que la respuesta fuese así, pero generalmente no es así. Would you mind opening the window? ¿Le importaría abrir la ventana? Entonces, ¿cuál sería la respuesta? No problem. No, no hay problema. Entonces ya no usamos el mismo auxiliar en esos casos. Es, o sea que no se podría, aunque yo, aunque yo quiera usarlo, yo quiera responder solo. Mm, lo más, sí, lo más viable sería dar, dar como que otro tipo de respuesta, ¿no? Posible respuesta. Ya, yeah. sería lo mejor basado en los ejemplos que tenemos ahí para que no se vayan a confundir. Ok, ¿qué otra qué? pregunta tiene? O, o, o referente, si quiere, uh, permítame. Vamos a retroceder el cassette aquí y vamos a irnos hasta ahí.
Cuando fue que vimos Google? Let me see where I am here. Eso creo que era de la, un, um, de, de la unidad 3. De la semana pasada, sí. Uh -huh. Permítame un segundo. Children. Okay. How to use could you and good you mind? Yeah, we have some example. Could you call me later? Y la respuesta es sure. En vez de decir yes, I could. ¿Sí? Could you make 10 copies uh -huh. of this paper right away? Could you contact the tech support? Uh -huh. No problem. Siempre debe de haber una respuesta diferente. ¿Sí? Ok. Ahora, aquí está la explicación de lo que usted quiere, mire. Permítanme, le voy a subrayar esto. Ah, ok, I'm going to highlight it. That, ok, right here. Ok, the expected answer for request with good new mind are not usually, no, I could no mind, but are the action that are request or short answer like the ones in the example above. Esto es cuando se refiere al a good you mind. Pero a este lado también nos dice algo. Se lo voy a marcar. Y es lo que usted me preguntó. Re dice answer to request with could you are not normally. Yes, I could or yes, I can. La respuesta dice solicitada cuando se usa could you no son normalmente yes I could or yes I can. The expected answer are the action that are requested. La respuesta esperada son las acciones que se han solicitado. Or short answer like the ones in the example above. O respuestas cortas como las que ya se han dado. Aquí están las dos respuestas de su pregunta. Ok. Ok. Muchas gracias. Muchas gracias, teacher. ¿Qué más? ¿Solo eso? ¿Y qué actividades le da falta? En, estuve revisando las notas. Creo que solo le hacen falta las de esta semana, ¿verdad? Eh, sí, solamente la del día de mañana. De esas tres días que faltan. De ahí el resto todas las tiene. Solo diez. Sí, ya. Y yeah. <ríe> eso espera. Ya el examen. Ya lo estaba comenzando. Ok. Ok, excelente. I don't know if you have any questions. More questions. No sé si tiene alguna otra pregunta. Solamente, teacher. Ah, ok. Bueno, entonces, thank you thank very you. much. Ok. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Ok, good night too.